How about George Soros? Uh, arguably, no matter whether you think he's um, funding good or bad um, causes, uh, openly claims to be trying to influence society on a global basis with lots and lots of influence and money. So is he a possible burner? Uh, more likely, uh, uh, from the perspective of the psychic conspirators, yes. Uh, from the perspective of psychic revolutionaries, he'd be the opposite. Uh, somebody who's trying to uh, quell the fire of human psyche uh, from flourishing. Uh, and so far as, you know, the causes, the causes that any philanthropist backs, be they good or evil, uh, popularly or according to the populist, uh, populace, uh, whatever causes they back, they're doing it financially. So even Elon Musk, as perhaps a political counterexample, uh, is applying financial uh, gains that he made, perhaps scrupulously or unscrupulously by inventing PayPal, uh, I think. Uh, he's applying those, those uh, financial gains to going to Mars and creating Neuralink and the, the Skylink satellite system, whatever those are. Uh, and again, he, he probably believes that he's doing the right thing and for the right reasons and that what he's doing is benevolent and beneficent and good and will improve society and, and humanity and nature in general. Uh, in a sense, only time can determine uh, whether or not he's right or wrong, but you know, from learning, learning from past history, uh, if you look at people who have gone before, who have attempted to uh, force global uh, or globalist agendas to occur, uh, you have people like Alexander the Great or uh, Julius Caesar or Napoleon or Hitler uh, or George W. Bush. And these are all people that are considered in hindsight less popular than they were during their own lives, which I think is an interesting point about the uh, great burner or a true Messiah or prophet would be that during their own lives, they're vilified. They're completely uh, shunned and exiled at best, if not crucified, murdered uh, violently. So uh, in a sense, it does behoove psychic revolutionaries as long as we or they are the minority to remain more or less in the shadows or secretive or occult even uh, so that we don't get murdered by the people who are in charge who want their, pol their political agendas to be seen historically as right and good, uh, but that don't want any alternatives to be allowed. <laughs>